What's going on guys, it's the Fox and in today's video tutorial we're going to be updating Atmosphere again. Yes, for the not one, not two, but third time. Okay, a new uh, build of Atmosphere came out. It is the pre-release. After this pack, I'm going to probably have another pack coming out that's even more stable than this pack. Um, the next pack that's, that will be coming out will probably be the final build, or maybe they'll just stick with a pre-release in it. So first things first, go ahead and put your SD card into the computer. Go ahead and download my pack right here. The latest version is October 16th pre-release. So right click the pack and press extract here. And I'll be back when that's done. Okay, open the folder up. And I want you to copy and paste and override everything onto the root of your SD card. If you're having any problems, any kind of weird problems where you're booting into atmosphere getting yellow screens or you're getting black screens with yellow writing on it what you need to do is you need to manually delete your folders here for instance match it up to what I have atmosphere then bootloader then config then the uh, and so on and so forth the other folders just match the directories so for instance delete atmosphere then delete bootloader then delete config so on and so forth then just manually put all the files and folders onto the root of your SD card and that should avoid any problems okay so I'm just going to copy and paste and override okay let that do its thing Forgot to say this at the beginning of the video, like in yesterday's pack. Uh, Tin, your favorite application is now working like it was the other day. And uh, the forwarders are working like it was yesterday. This is just a more stable version of Atmosphere. Less bugs and less um, headaches for you guys. So I just wanted to mention that. Okay, take your SD card out of the computer. And let's uh, put the uh, loader into the computer. People have been asking me, what is the loader? This is the loader. There's certain things I can say, there's certain things I cannot say. You want to go ahead and plug this into the computer with a, uh, with a micro data connection cable so we can copy and paste and override the payload.bin file. Okay, now that we have our loader into the computer, you want to open up this folder right here, atmosphere underscore Hikakte. Then we're going to copy and paste and override the file. Okay, after that's copied over and updated, go ahead and uh, put your SD card back into your system and let's go ahead and boot it up and I'll show you what to do next. Over here, click on the launch section. Click on P offline. I'm not allowed to say that word, but click on that one. It's booting up, I'll be back when it's done. As you can tell, we're on the latest and greatest OFW 19.0.0 with AMS 1.8.0.0. E means EmuNAND, S means stock NAND. If you haven't updated your EmuNAND, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to um, update the uh, EmuNAND. So on a previous title on the home screen, you need to perform a title override, hold down the right trigger, press A and press A one more time. Also a new application has been added to the pack. It's called Breeze. I don't mess with it. I did some testing in there just to do some finang uh, just to do some testing and whatnot. Okay, so we're gonna update the firmware. I'm not gonna do the whole process because I'm already on the latest build. I don't want to waste time because it's late. That's what I said yesterday too. LOL. Open up Daybreak. Press install. You want to press firmware 19. I'll be back when that's done. Go ahead, press continue, press preserve settings, install FAT32. From here, I can't go on, otherwise it's going to start writing the files and stuff. When they ask you, do you want to do a reboot or shutdown, go ahead and do a, um, a shutdown. I always tell everybody to do that, but if you don't want to, to go ahead and press reboot um, to each his own. Everything has been thoroughly tested. I test this a few times today. Um, my friend tested this. Had a couple of problems, so I'm waiting to hear back and see what's going on with that switch, uh, with that system, and see what's going on. Um, 
the mileage may vary. It might work for you. It might not work for you. People are getting all different. Um, I'm getting all different feedback from the other forums I belong to. People are, are updating without a problem. People are updating. They are having problems. Most of the times that people are causing the problems are they just fast forward through the video guide and say, oh, just do this and do that and do this, not following instructions. And it causes problems. For instance, somebody used my pack the other day and ran into a problem, which I've never seen before. I think it was called a 006 error. I forget what it's called. Basically, um, Hikakte and Atmosphere were not matching. So he didn't update his loader and that caused a uh, problem. Um, but it's, you know... Everything's still in beta, even though that this is a uh, pre-release, it's technically still a beta build, but there's more um, performance and there's more stabilization to it. I have not seen any improvements in the um, atmosphere from when, from when 18 got first released up until now. I'm sure it's way more stable and there's stuff that's buried in the code that's working much better. Um, anyway, guys. That's it for the video tutorial guide. Like and subscribe to the Fox, and it really does help. Share out the content. We need to get everybody updated so everybody can start using their handheld and having fun with it. Um, there's going to probably be, well, like I said in the beginning of the video, there's probably going to be one more uh, pack, or it all depends if, you know, if they release another atmosphere build. So I'll catch you guys later. Thank you so much. Oh, and you can find the um, link to the pack in the um, show notes.